I'm Matt Zahn. Justin Steele's great starting pitch and was, pitching was one of the reasons the Cubs surged post All-Star break last season. With his off-season home in Arizona, he's able to train there year-round. Marshall Harris spoke with the young lefty about what's next in his development. And I've been excited all offseason. I've been here waiting on everybody to get here. So it's just nice to have everybody here. With the way Justin Steele finished his second season in the majors, why wouldn't he want to get an early start on season three as a big league starter? The 27-year-old led the Cubs in strikeouts last year while only giving up nine total earned runs over his final 10 starts. I think that's for anybody. You know, you get a little bit of success, you want to continue it and, you know, build off of it. So I would, I would say it definitely has. It makes me uh, want to repeat it, show that I can do it again, and, you know, just keep building off of it. Yeah, I had a really nice season last year. I think he grew a lot, learned a lot about himself last year, and having that success, honing that in and being consistent with that. As good as Steele was in 2022, the lefty is adamant there's plenty of room for improvement as shown by his tangible goals for the season ahead. He's aiming for new personal highs. Something I want to do is have 30-plus starts, 180-plus innings. Um, you know, I think if I'm able to do that, I put myself and the team in a pretty good spot. One of the ways Steele is looking to improve is by building on his relationship with Jan Gomes and new catcher Tucker Barnhart. He's even played golf with Barnhart a couple of times, admitting he's gotten the best of him. Still just hoping both those catchers can get the best out of him in 2023. In Arizona with the Cubs, Marshall Harris, CBS 2 News.